Text alignment. Alignment refers to the setting, the direction or position of the text. There are four types of text alignment in MS Word. Align left, center, align right and justify. Note, by default, the text is left aligned. Align left. It sets the text to the left margin. Center. It sets the text to the center of the left and right margins. Align right. It sets the text to the right margin. Justify. It sets the text evenly between the left and right margins. Steps to change the text alignment are Select the text that has to be aligned. In the Home tab in Paragraph Group, click on the Desired Alignment button. The text will be aligned as per the requirement. Shortcut Align text left, Ctrl plus L. Center, Ctrl plus E. Align text right, Ctrl plus R. Justify, Ctrl plus J. Bullet, Ctrl plus Shift plus L. Bullets and Numbering Bullets and Numbering feature is used to represent the text in a listed points form. A listed text is more readable and easy to understand. Bullets These are used when there is no particular sequence of the text to be followed. Numbers are alphabets. These are used when there is a sequence of the items to be followed. Steps to apply the bulleted list are Select the text on which you want to apply the bullet. On the Home tab in Paragraph Group, click the drop-down arrow on the Bullets button. Select the required bullet. The selected text gets converted in a bulleted list. Steps to apply the numbered list are Select the text on which you want to apply the numbers. On Home tab in Paragraph Group, click the drop-down arrow on Numbering button. Select the required number format. The selected text gets converted in the numbered list. Note, numbered lists can be created manually. Steps to create a numbered list manually are Place the typing cursor at the beginning of the first sentence. Type 1, put a dot and press space bar. A tabular space is set automatically. Now repeat the process at the beginning of other sentences with increment in the number. 9. And paragraph spacing Line spacing It is the vertical space between the lines of text in a paragraph. Paragraph spacing It is the space above or below a paragraph. Steps to set the line and paragraph spacing are Select the text Click on drop-down arrow button on line and paragraph spacing button. To set the line spacing, click on required line spacing option. To set the paragraph spacing, click on add space before paragraph or add space after paragraph option. As per the requirement, see the changes in the line spacing of the selected text in the document. Note. Line spacing options aren't limited to the line and paragraph spacing menu. To set the spacing with more precision, select line spacing options from the menu to access the paragraph dialog box or click on paragraph dialog box launcher. The paragraph dialog box appears. In the indents and spacing tab, you can set the line spacing and paragraph spacing with more precision. Border and shading, text or paragraph or page. Steps to set border and shading are Select the text. On Home tab in Paragraph group, click on drop down arrow on Borders button. Click on Border and Shading option. The Border and Shading dialog box appears. There are three tabs on this dialog box Borders, Page Border, and Shading. Now, set the following using these tabs. A. Setting text or paragraph border. To set the text or paragraph borders, click on borders tab, click any one option in settings section, example, box. Select any line style in style section. 
You can scroll to see the line styles. Set the border color using color list box. Click drop down arrow and select the color. Set line width using width list box. Select paragraph from apply to list box. Click on OK button. B. Setting page border. To set the page borders, click on page border tab. Click any one option in setting section. Example, box. Select any line style in style section. You can scroll to see the line styles. Set the border color from color list box. Click on drop down arrow and select the color. Set line width using width list box. You can also select any artwork as the page border. Select any artwork using art list box. Select any required option from apply to list box. By default, it is whole document. Click on OK button. C. Setting color shading. To set the color shading to the selected text or paragraph, click on shading tab. Select any color from fill list box. Select any required option from apply to list box. By default, it is paragraph. Click on OK button. Note. Steps to set color background to the text are Select the text behind which you want to apply the color background. On Home tab in Paragraph group, click the drop-down arrow on Shadings button. Select the required color for the background from the Colors grid. The required color background is applied on the selected text. Watermark in the document Adding watermark. Steps to add a watermark in the document are On Design tab in Page Background group, click on drop down arrow of watermark button. A list of watermark styles appears. Click on Desired option. Removing watermark. Once a watermark added in the document can be removed later. Steps to remove a watermark are On Design tab in Page Background group, Click on drop down arrow of watermark button. Click on remove watermark option. Custom watermark. You can add your own text or image instead of the default text as a watermark. Steps to add custom watermark are On design tab in page background group, click on drop down arrow of watermark button. Click on custom watermark option. The printed watermark dialog box appears. To add your own text, click on the text watermark radio button. Type the desired text in text text box. Set the font using font list box. Set the text size using size list box. Set the text color using color list box. Set the text layout diagonal or horizontal. Click on OK button. The text is inserted as a watermark on the page. To add an image, click on Picture Watermark Radio button. Click on Select Picture button. A window appears to insert the picture from a file or from the Internet. Click on From a File option, the Insert Picture dialog box appears. Locate and select the desired picture. Click on Insert button. The selected picture is inserted as a watermark on the page.